Okay, we got a lot of questions about clasps for Bolo. So this is a class on clasps. So let's have a little discussion and we'll walk you through the three different kinds and how they work and when you'd use different ones. As you can see, three families here. These are what we call glue-on discs. These are Bennett's, small and a large one. And these are what we call tension clasps. They come in three different finishes. These come in two finishes. Let's talk about the glue-on discs first. The major advantage here is that they're cheap and you can swap the cords. Cheap like a quarter a piece for just one. I wanted to go brown because you're wearing brown boots that day. Well, they slip in no problem and into, into the uh, bolo. And if you want to go black because you got black boots, same deal. The problem is, the only disadvantage is they scrape the leather. They work obviously by friction and eventually you're gonna wear out the cord. The other nice thing is you can go, you can, you can swap the color of the cord if you wanna go uh, put a red one on for Christmas and black one the rest of the year, go ahead, it, it happens. But again, they can degrade the cord over time. And we sell replacement cords if you like, but that's uh, a glue on discs. Okay, these are Bennett's. Bennett's have been around for a long time. Um, this is a small Bennett and this is the larger Bennett. Nice thing about small Bennett's is they're small. So if you have a bolo element that's kind of narrow or small and you got to hide it, you want to see the clasp showing, you can fit that on there. So that's a nice thing. The action on both Bennett's, the big and the small, is they bite down on the, um, on the cord. This one will take a smaller three millimeter piece like this. This is a narrower gauge uh, cord and it clips down kind of nicely. It will not take a big thick one. This is uh, probably four-ish or maybe a little bit bigger. It's, it's barely, it's almost not gonna fit in there and to clamp it down, it's gonna take a, a real big bite out of it. So that's a small one. As I said, the big disadvantage doesn't handle largest cords. You also cannot swap color cords. If you're going to Christmas, you know, green and red and black, you're not gonna, you're not gonna do it here. These are the large Bennett's. Large Bennett's come in two pieces. Um, you put them together by putting these little pins in the guides, little holes in the guides on the sides, and squeezing it together with a pair of pliers. So the metal on these is very soft, much softer than the um, small Bennett's. So you can pull these up with a pair of pliers to pull this out, and these guides open up plenty so that you could put a cord in even with tips and fit it through there, most of the cords, or you could slip it in the middle. But I will tell you, all Bennett's, because of the action of the jaws, jaws have teeth, they bite. They don't bite hard, but even here, you can see just doing that, we've taken two nice little bite marks out of it. And this cord is dyed on the outside, so it's cutting through the color. The ones we like best are right here, the tension class. And these are actually in the middle of the price between the Bennett's and the, um, the glue-on discs. Again, come in three different colors. Beauty of these is the performance. They will take, very forgiving, they will take any size cord diameter. Here's one. That's about a little, probably a little over three. Here's one maybe a little under three, and it holds both of them very nicely. It does not bite. The spring action is springy metal, and it just comes up and clamps in the guide there and holds it tightly. It doesn't bite, just holds it very nicely. The only downside is they, you can't swap the cords after you put the tips on. Let me show you exactly what we're talking about. So here's a piece of brown cord. Uh, let's assume here in this example, you've already put your piece on there. Maybe it's a deer antler or fossil or something. It's on the front and now you're threading the cord in and ready to put the tips on. You would glue the tips on, I'm not going to glue them on right here, but this is not going to be a pulled through those guides. If there's just no, no way a tip is going to fit through there. So once you have that color on that bolo, that's it. If you're brown, you're brown. It's black, it's black, red, green, blue, whatever you want. It's, it, it's not going to move. So, we've gone through the three families of clasps, your tensions, your Bennett's, and your glue-on discs. Hope you found that helpful, and give us a call if you need anything else. We're here to help. Thanks.